Rainier or something like that. Be like, yo, Rainier, I need you to do me a solid. <laughs> I need you to crush, e like, I, I don't care how you do it. Like, you can get second to last or whatever. You just gotta make sure he doesn't win. Hey, Dr. Bois, yo, thank you. Thank you for joining, I appreciate it. Thank you for that, good luck. Just please uh, close the stream uh, while you're watching and thank you very much, good luck. Um, all right, what are we doing? We got it. We got to get a W for the believers here. We got to get a win for the believers here. Now that there's there's real cash money, i.e., econ bucks on the line. The, <laughs> no, dude, Rainier's got my number. Rainier actually crushes me in a lot of. Rainier actually has got my number a lot. Like Rain, Rainier wins more times than he loses against me. Um, we we have quite a history at this point. Uh, I do get a lot of insane hands though. Uh, I'm gonna pick a root balancer. This is a very obvious root balancer. Root balancer is very good here. I do like excavator a lot. Um, I like organic farmer a lot. The, both these cards I like. I also like stone carver. Wait a second. Wait a second, chat. Chat. I see some spicy meatballs here. I see a very spicy meatball. Oh, but I also the root balancer conservator. No, dude. I want to do this so bad. I want to generate a bunch of stone stone carve it. I want to do it so bad. I want to do it so bad. It's so bad, but I want to do it really badly. Oh, I want to do it so bad. It's so funny. Roof Alistair Conservator is so good though. Oh, but this seems so cool though. Let's get wacky. Let's get a little, I'm feeling the stone carver on it. I'm feeling excavator stone carver. Let's do it. I'm going second too. Yeah, I'm so in on this. I am so in on this. Yeah, this is a, a very likely combo to wheel. I agree. Um, so I don't need food. My food's gonna be good. We're not gonna count beans because bean counter sucks. <laughs> Too bad you can't change your prediction. You can't change your prediction. You got screwed. <laughs> uh, Clayhot Builder is quite fine. I have two ox I wanna play early. That means I'm probably not playing House Steward. Um, Clayhot Builder's not terrible here. Sheepwalker and Layabout are also not terrible. But yeah, with early clay, I actually don't mind taking a clay hut builder here. Yeah, Stone Carver is always wheeling. Stone Carver is always wheeling here. I think Clay Hut Builder is going to be fine here. I'm pretty high on Clay Hut Builder, especially with like this. If I get a, a um, what's it called here? It's GG. A, a card that lets me reno on day labor. It's actually GG here. Although this card's after, which is kind of unfortunate, but that's okay. Yeah, I think I'm in on this. I think I think Clay Hut Builder is going to line up right. Yeah, if we get a Cottager, it's going to be hot. We're gonna we're gonna have some spice going on if we get a cottager here. Cottager is gonna be heavy spice. If we get a cottager, it's gonna be very heavy spice. The spice levels are gonna be very high if we get a cottager here. We want a um. What do I want? I want a uh. What is it called? Ram clay. Ram clay is what we want. Um, I, yeah, see, like, I, I normally I don't like Excavator, but with Wheeling Stone Carver, Stone Carver is very legitimately, like, it's a lot of food with uh, if you can convert a lot of stone, and so we have a way to do that. So that's, like, really nice. This pack sucks. <laughs> this pack is really bad. I am... Interior Decorator is still fine. I, I am so high on Interior Decorator. Like, it's so good um, if you can reno early. If you're renoing early, Interior Decorator is so insane. The problem is I'm not renoing to stone early. That's the biggest problem with the Interior Decorator here. Building Tycoon is just, like, super annoying. I might Building Tycoon, honestly. Like, Building Tycoon is very, very annoying. Um, seed Trader. If I have a lot of food, I don't have that much food. This is not that much food. D d this combo is not that much food. It's just, like, consistent food, it, but it's not actually that much food. Um, it's not that much food. Yeah, the, it, this card is very expensive. Um, I think Building Tycoon is fine. I think Building Tycoon has enough instances where it lets me squeeze into a growth queue. It's also very annoying to get this card played against you. Um, I think I'm fine with this. I think that Groom could be, like, okay here, but I'm willing to take Building Tycoon, considering that I already have two Ox that I want to plan turn rounds one and two i don't want to plan on playing more ox here than those two ox i would rather just play those ox and then just like see what's going to happen in the future i think that playing those ox is going to be totally fine and i i, I want to have the rest of my ox be a little bit more situational a little bit more later game ox i i don't want to have ox that are going to be played like immediately there's gonna be a lot of stone in this game if this stone carver doesn't kind of if it does not come back then everything is out the window for this game <laughs>
<laughs> if the stone carver doesn't come back, if the stone carver doesn't wheel, everything is out the window for this game, and we're just gonna we're just gonna <laughs> we're gonna be in bad shape if it doesn't wheel. Well, not we're not gonna be in bad shape, but it's gonna be really awkward if it doesn't wheel. Yeah, C Trader is good in the late game. Like, C Trader randomly is insane, like, in the late game. Like, if you can stack up a bunch of food on it and then get, like, a really key timed plow, so it's very insane. It's really, really good. So, like, if you can do that, it's really nice. Um, yeah, if, well, no, I, th I think it's good. I think it's pretty good. I honestly think it's pretty good. I think it's pretty likely, honestly. Like, it's so bad with so many other cards. Like, like nobody really likes Stone Trader that much, right? Whoo, we could do Stone Cutter stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Stone Cutter, eh? Stone Cutter, good. I've been a little lower on Stone Cutter recently. Seed Seller is fine too. I actually like Seed Seller a lot. Seed Seller is like a pretty efficient way to get grain. Oh yeah, no, Roof Baluster is a way better card. Roof Baluster is a way better card, but Excavator and doing stuff with Excavator is way sweeter. Ah, oh, Stone Cutter is so tempting here. Seed Seller is also tempting. Seed Seller is really good. Seed Seller is like really, really good, but like Stone Cutter is very tempting. Like I am gonna have a decent amount of stone. Um, but I'm also going to be eating all my stone. I might have a decent amount of stone. It might be okay. I might be able to, like, pottery or something like that. <laughs> you could have, hey, you could have waited. Do I seed seller or stone cutter? I think stone cutter synergizes enough with what we're doing. I think seed seller is, like, very good, obviously. I think this synergizes enough that I'm happy with it. Well, that's poop. <laughs> How did this happen? How is this possible that this happened? I'm very sad. Uh, I'm so sad. What do I do instead? I mean, I guess I'm taking Organic Farmer and we're just gonna pray that something good happens. That's so upsetting. I can't believe, okay, so what, what cards went? It was Conservator, that card and that. I can't believe someone picked my my Stone Carver over Organic Farmer, that's crazy. That is, that is some big poop. Well, now we're sad on a Wednesday. Um, maybe Frame Builder's okay? <laughs> yeah, Believers? <laughs> Um, maybe Frame Builder's okay here. I can go Reno to Clay. Excavator is actually quite good if we're frame building. <laughs> you know what? Let's do it. Stone into nine points each harvest. Uh, yeah, I agree. Wow, House Steward Wheel. That's craziness. That's actually insane, that House Steward Wheeled. Um, this is definitely not a Freemason game, I don't think. Okay, Freemason Frame Builder. Is that a thing that I can do with Stone Cutter? Pause champ? Wait, pause champ chat? Wait a second. That would make my stone rooms cost... Two stone. Yeah, the read is really bad. The read is really bad for doing that. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna pick house steward. Yeah, if I had kept conservator, I could do this. But yeah, I'm not freemasoning. No, this is still fine. This is still fine. We're still fine here. Um, is interior decorator okay? Interior decorator might still be fine. The problem is that I don't want to reno to um stone at all early. Skillful Renovator might actually be okay here. It might be okay. I don't think it's going to be great, but it might be fine. It might be reasonable. Yeah, I mean, that was crazy. That was a crazy game. I, I can't believe that game worked out as well as it did. That was craziness. All right. You know what? My food sucks. We're going to make it work with Stonecutter here somehow. Uh, I have to pick Rammed Clay here because Rammed Clay is completely nuts with this uh, with this game. It's completely insane. Um, Lumber Mill is good. 
I'd be fine. Uh, this pack is really good, actually. It's just a good pack. Um, I don't want Lantern House. Lantern House is not going to happen this game. Lumber Mill would be really good. Ramp Clay is just so insane. I, I'm going to have so much clay this game. I'm going to have so much clay this game because of Clay Hut Builder. Um, I, I think that Frame Builder is going to add even more clay. I think that uh, Ramp Clay is just too good here. I think that Wheeling Lumber Mill would be insane here, but like honestly, any of these cards are pretty good. Uh, Reed Pond would also be good for us here. We need a lot of Reed this game, so. Yeah, there's also Clay Deliver, man. Passing Ramp Clay just sucks because you know that someone's going to take starting player for it early on-ish and it's going to be bad. But yeah, Ramp Clay is nuts here. Our hand is like kind of interesting. Our hand is really, really interesting. Even in spite of the fact that we got totally hosed on on taking our, on our Stone Carver. I don't know who likes Stone Carver, but I'm sad about it. It won't stop me from being sad about it. Excavator might still be good here. Excavator gives us a lot of resources that we really want here. Um, although I might read Stone Food on turn one. If we if we read Stone Food is the turn one action, then that's fine. Lone Pit would be nuts. I mean, if we get a Lone Pit, it's crazy. Yeah, I, I don't know what happened. I don't know why House Steward wheeled, but not not Stone Carver. I mean, they were in different packs to be totally fair, but yeah, it's it's pretty ridiculous. Um, it doesn't look too bad. I don't think it looks too bad. I mean, it it, it doesn't look great. <laughs> doesn't look terrible. I I think the stone is good. Like the stone, the like oh, 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 oh let's go. <laughs> All right, believers, where are you at? Where where were you at, believers? I I had you the entire time. I had you the whole time, believers. I had you the whole time. I got your back. I've got you. I got your back, believers. Let's go. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. No, nah, we don't need roof baluster. There's so much stone in this game. There's gonna be so much stone in this game. It'll be fine. Well, okay, now excavator looks really bad. <laughs> now excavator looks pretty bad. We're taking readstone food of our first action, and with like every single action here, we're readstone fooding every single action of the game. House steward looking great. Uh, we're not building four cooking hearts. We're, we're building eight cooking hearts. Like, yeah. God, this game's gonna be so good. Yeah, excavator sucks. Oh, yeah, excavator bad. Uh, unfortunately, we tried with excavator. It's just bad. Unless we get a, a freaking. Even if we get a, a lone pit here, actually, I, I think I might not play excavator. <laughs> we need we need the minor improvements. Oh, ravenous hunger. I disagree with that. I don't know why we need ravenous hunger, but um, I disagree with that. So we're going, what are our ox order going to be? We're going house steward into frame builder into clay hut builder, I think. I think we're just not playing any of the other ox. And we're taking reedstone food literally every chance it gets to us. I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, the first room might be in clay. It's going to depend. It depends a lot on like how the game goes, but like it could be in clay. It could be in, uh, in, in, um, Wood, it just depends. It's just going to depend. His frame builder is going to be huge. Oh my god. Dude. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait. Stop. 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 I'm very sad about this pack. Wow, this pack's nuts. What the heck? Mm, dude. Excavator loam pit, though. Oh man, the four and eight is so ridiculous for us. I mean, I have to take the lone pit here. I have to take the lone pit. I, I don't think I have a choice. I mean, with rammed clay, especially the lone pit is like way too good. Uh, we want so we want four and eight because um, it, it we're we're building five rooms and when you're building five rooms, four and eight is completely nuts. Um, we might wheel the four and eight on us. Like it's possible we wheel it. Excavator for the content. I have, I think Lone Pit is slightly too good here. I think it's very slightly too good. Oh God, it screws up my early actions though. I have to think about this. I have to think about it. I gotta think about it. Uh, it screws up my early actions so much. Fortnite might actually just be better. Mm, is that stupid to say? That might be the dumbest thing I've ever said in my life.
Dude, I need so much read, though. <sighs> How do I play the Lumpit and the Clay Supports? How do I play them both? I just can't play them both here. I don't need this much clay. I legitimately don't need this much clay because I have freaking clay supports. I have clay supports frame builder. Why do I need clay? I don't actually need clay. I need the food. I need the food worse. My, the food situation is way worse. I don't need it. I don't need it. I honestly don't need it. I don't need it because I build rooms for two wooden to clay. I build rooms for two wooden to clay. So I literally don't need the clay. Like the clay here is just for fences. So I, I just take Fornade here. Fornade is just better. It's like just better. Oh, Rehad Toad is actually nuts here. Rehad Toad is absolutely insane. Um, I I don't have to, but it's really good. It's really, really good. Um, yeah, Toad is going to be insane here. We need so much read this game. With 4 and 8 too, especially, we need so much read this game. Rehad Toad is insane here. All right, we're in it. All right, chat, we did it. <laughs> we lived the dream. We lived the dream. We did it. I do need it. I, I need I need the Fornade here. The Fornade patches up all the holes in my game, which is that my food is really bad. Um, I need food for rounds for my Ox too, which is really important. Um, so like that's my big hole in my game right now. Uh, it could wheel. If it doesn't wheel, I'm not going to be shocked about it. Yeah, like Fornade is just better there, I think. I mean, the, the Clay Hut Builder is giving me every single piece of clay that I need. Like I don't necessarily need to play the Frame Builder, but I'm going to. Um, Wow, do I do I take reed pond here? And I just never take a reed action ever. The problem is that reedstone food is like actually insane for me too. I guess I can just build BMW. I guess I can just build like 10 rooms. That's fine, right? Building 10 rooms. I don't want private forest. Yeah, we don't want private forest here. Ideally in my first turn, I go like reedstone food into start player reed head toad or Aki to start player or something like that. Um, I think reed pond is gonna be fine. I don't see a world in which Lantern House gets there. A uh, long-term feeding plan, uh, we'll figure it out. <laughs> we'll figure it out later. And we'll figure it out later. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Um, by three rooms. I could win it by a lot of rooms, but I don't know about three rooms. Um, clay pipe's gotta be. Oh, clay pipe doesn't work with um with clay hut builder. That's one thing that I learned is that clay pipe doesn't work with clay hut builder. Farm store might be quite good here. Farm store looks quite good to me here. All these cards are so ugly. <laughs> Can I say that? Is that is that is that say like all these cards like look like pretty mopey, <laughs> but like together they're gonna be very powerful. Except for the clay supports. Clay supports is beautiful, but they all like match it. Um, farm store is interesting. Claims for free. Yeah, unfortunately I did pick the roof baluster because because I bad, but we got the frame builder anyway, so there's that. Uh clay pipe can't be good, right? I I might need more food though. I mean BMW is gonna be great. Yeah, maybe a farm store is okay. The problem with farm store is that cost food. I'm gonna take the clay pipe here. I think clay pipe's gonna be easier to play. I, I think that that's gonna be a big deal. <sighs> I have so many Myers I need to play. So many Myers I need to play here. We're gonna play this in case our food situation's bad. No, I, I changed my mind again. This gives me veggies. Veggies are something that I don't really have good access to, and that's kind of nice. Well, <laughs> I forgot about this card. Whoopsies, I forgot about this. Yeah, I mean, I probably should have picked Clay Pipe. I mean, Farm Store could have been okay, I guess, but um, this is worth a point. Sure, why not? Why not? I thought about the clay pipe. The problem is that clay pipe doesn't work with my reed hatted toads or my clay hut builder or anything like that. Like it just doesn't work with anything. Um, all right, cards are getting small again. Good, say goodbye to the big cards. We would like reed stone food with our first action. That would be very cool because we need stone and we need food and we need reed. Um, and then we're gonna we're gonna try and build. Yeah, we're gonna reed stone food. Start player Ock here is gonna be our sequence, I think. All right, never mind. I guess we're gonna go Ock into start player into reed stone food. I guess that works too. Um, definitely house steward, definitely house steward here. Yeah, definitely house steward. Definitely house steward. And then we will start player into reed stone food. Actually, this works out better for me because then I get to Ock right after too. I get to play a frame builder. I may build in reed and I might build in clay. I have not decided yet. 
hopefully red does not pick uh, or they shouldn't start player here they shouldn't start player oh this card's so good i love this card so much this card's so so good uh, yeah we'll build and read yeah, yeah 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 we're building and read for sure for sure we're building and read for absolutely uh, we got Toad here. God, I have so many miners that are so insane here. Yeah, we got Toad. Toad is like so nuts for us. We got Toad. Got to play the Toad. There, there's someone with a Toad. Oh, there was someone with a Toad icon in the game earlier. Must play Toad. Toad, very important. And then, yeah, we just take wood. Yeah, it's fine. We don't even need uh, clay to reno to clay here. We just need wood. So like we just take wood and then if it lines up that we can build, great. If it doesn't line up that we can build, that's also great. Farm store might be good. Farm store might be okay. The problem with farm store is that I have so many miners I want to play early. Like I really want to play this foreign aid at some point. Although I probably won't try and play foreign aid until um, a little bit later on. Like I probably won't try and play it for until a little teeny bit later on. But yeah, every readstone food is gonna be good. I, I probably will try and build basket maker or not basket maker. Basket makers could be good too. But yeah, basket makers is good. Um, improvements. Oh, this has got to be. I know. What the, no, I don't know what this is. I thought I knew what this is, but it, it's not what I thought. Um, yeah, we can play it on growth. Oh, bookcase. All right, this person's doing very good things. God, dude, wood expert into bookcase is so dumb. What a good combo. <laughs> That's a pretty good combo. That's a good one. Um, I'll take Reedstone food here. The Reedstone food is incredible, and I need a lot of read early. And then I'll Auk if, if Auk gets back to me. And if not, then I'll take the other good action. I guess I could start player again. <laughs> and piss off Red. <laughs> Make Red very sad by start playing again. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no, chat. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Boss music is playing. <laughs> Chat, the boss music's playing. Uh oh. Uh oh. Da 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 da. <laughs> Hold on. Wait, Chat, I, I hear boss. Oh, wait, Chat, do you, do you hear it? Chat, do you hear the boss music? Chat, do you hear, do you hear it? Chat, uh oh. Uh oh, Chat. Uh oh, Monka S. <laughs> I guess I'll take wood here. Wood's not bad either. Uh oh, chat. <laughs> Monka S. No, dude, not like this. All right, we'll take this. We might build one room in wood. Yo, what's up, Killzar? How's it going? Yeah, these seem pretty good. I agree. Well, now I'm sad that we passed this long pit. I'm very sad he passed a little bit. Oh, no! Wait, is the person have a childless? Are we getting childless here? That would be very sad. That would be very sad if we're getting childless here. I'd be not happy about that. I think, unfortunately, my first room has to be in wood. Very unfortunate, because it, like, lines up way too well here. But, yeah, I want to get the three ox really bad. <laughs> <laughs> the boss music, dude. Oh, dude, the Lone Pit's coming. The Lone Pit is absolutely coming here, and there's nothing that I can do to stop it. At least we can give them the ramp clay. <laughs> At least they don't have the ramp clay or the clay supports. That would also be bad. That would also be very bad. All right, you can take clay. Okay, well, it's not It's not a uh, thing. Well, we're hoping for Reedstone food to come around. If Reedstone food doesn't come around, it's going to be a little bit sad. Oh, man, dude, I have a terrible feeling about this. It's going to be like Auk into Loam Pit or something like that. Something really degenerate. Oh, I really want Reedstone food to come around. Really want Reedstone food. I guess I could go Reno Clay Supports. Maybe Reno Clay Supports is the way to go. Yep. Yepers. At least we didn't pass the Excavator to this Gerson. That's good. <laughs> good that we didn't pass Excavator. Oh, Cattle Whisper. Okay, 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 okay. We're back in it. Okay, we're back in it. Th these, this is not the most powerful card they could have played. Th this is totally acceptable. All right, they're playing something different. Never mind. All right, I'm going back to chill music. The, the boss, I, I, I... Yeah. <laughs> Joke's over. No, Shops... Oh, my God! Shops and Silver is also in this draft. Oh, no, dude. Oh, no, Shops and Silver is also in this draft. Oh, no. No, dude, not like this. I need this Reedstone food, though. Can I get this Reedstone food, please? Can I please get this Reedstone food? Oh, yes. Let me cap this Reedstone food. Thank you so much. I need this so bad. 
I need it so bad. I need to be able to build or something. I guess I need a clay. Needing a clay to reno is kind of awkward, actually. It's very awkward to need a clay to reno here. Yeah, that's really awkward. I really would love to wait to build a room here. That would be so nice. Um, I do if I build a room. If I build a room, I need a clay, which is really awkward. I guess I play Skillful Renovator for the clay and get some wood, but that seems bad. <laughs> it's like three wood and a clay, maybe. Okay, Charcoal Burner. Okay, we're getting greedy. Yeah, I'll take Greedstone Food. I'll just take it. It's so good for me. I can't pass it up. Can't pass it up. Uh, because the stone helps me build improvements that I need to feed later on in the game. Uh, the reed helps me reno to build rooms. Um, the reed could help me build BMW later on, which I might do. The stone is really important. The stone is how I'm feeding this game. I I'm feeding with the stone this game for, for the early game. Like we're feeding with Fornade and stone. And then after that, uh, I'm gonna feed off, yeah, I mean, uh, Pottery is going to be pretty nuts for us this game, I think. I think pottery is going to be completely insane this game. Starting player here. All right, this person clearly wanted Reedstone food to, to use their power ceramics. I guess that's fine. Is my music a little loud? Eh, it's kind of fine. I'll turn it down a little bit. I'll turn it down just a little teeny bit here. Uh, what else do I take here? I'm tempted to just take wood and not build yet. I'm, I'm very tempted to not build yet. Building it now is so bad. It's so bad to build here. Yeah, it's really bad to build here, um, actually. Like, it, it could be good if it, if it like, like the problem is that I don't know when, like, Reno is gonna flip and I don't know when Build Rooms is gonna flip. So it makes it kind of awkward. I'm very tempted to take three reed here, or three three clay here. Three clay here, I think, is reasonable. The reason I think that three clay is reasonable is that um, it means that on the reno, I can just build the, the pottery immediately if I get that. It also means that um, I can I have an extra clay to reno to clay if I decide to build a room later on. I think both of those fail states are good, so I think three clay makes sense here. The food situation, I want this food, but I can always start player four and eight if I really need to. So we're gonna take this three clay here. I think this is fine. This is totally fine here. And then my goal is to take a food action this turn and then take a uh, uh, an awk. So we're gonna take a food action, a four food action. If it gets to me, I will absolutely take, um, but otherwise we're gonna play an awk. Which a four food action could get to, could get to me here. I, I think that, that Kandinsky Green definitely wants to take Reedstone food here because Kandinsky definitely wants to build a, um, what is it called? A, uh, I, I, it's a little greedy to do. Like, it's a little bit greedy. This is a little bit greedy. It's a little bit scary. Like, Alco could day labor, and then we could traveling players fishing, and then that would totally screw Kandinsky, which would be unfortunate for them. I don't know if that's going to happen. Yeah, it's a little greedy. They're going to maybe change their mind. I mean, it, it's, like, not terrible. Like, I don't I don't know if Major Meyer's getting taken. I, like, Dr. Block can't take Major Meyer, actually. Major Meyer's never getting taken. So this is actually totally fine. It's totally fine to take Reedstone food here. There's no chance Major Meyer gets taken. If it gets taken, it's just, well, oh, but Dr. Block could, could Major Miner and then take the sheep. Uh, a green, green wants it so bad because they would like to build a oven here because they have um, potter ceramics. So potter ceramics, um, they want to build an oven and then use the clay to bake bread. It's kind of risky. I don't know what Red's doing here. I really have no idea what Red's doing. Like if Red is like planning on feeding with sheep, which I think is a mistake if they do that, uh, but they could very well do that. Um, if they feed off the sheep, then then that's bad for them. I, I think that the fail state on, I, I think they have to read stone food here. I think the fail state on read stone food is like too, the, I don't know. It's too, There's too too many fine things that can happen after read stone food here. Like like the, the fail state is not that bad. Like you get the, the, the clay oven eventually. Like you still get it eventually. Yeah, I, I don't like this. I, I, don't, I don't think this is great. I mean, this does mean I'm gonna start player here and I might build. Oh, but then that means they can build two. Hmm. God, I want to build the first room so bad here. Oh, I want to build the first room so bad. Yeah, building the first room is pretty nuts here, huh? It's so good. 
I will need more wood if I do this. Hi, Fofo, how are you? Um, I I want to build into starting player four and eight. I think I could also ramp clay. Yeah, the one the one clay is actually huge. Um, I can also clay supports. Maybe I don't need to play the frame builder. Oh, uh, it's so awkward to build here though. The problem is that if I don't build here, I'm just never getting to build. So I think I have to build here. Uh, we're building rooms for very cheap. We're, we're building cheap rooms this game. I have to build here, unfortunately. It's very sad to burn this much wood to build, but I think that it's worth it to just hop into the, the queue and be fine. I gotta do it. Otherwise, I, I don't get to build ever here, which is really unfortunate. Um, yeah, we're, we're clay supporting. Clay supports is the, the plan. That's annoying. Like grow flip here once, one time. Can we can we have grow flipping first year for for the lulls? I do. I I actually am fine taking starting like a bunch here. I I could just take four wood here. If four wood gets to me, I could just take four wood and then I can just like up starting player a lot in the future and then just like get my clay rooms in like rounds like you know nine or ten or something like that. I think that's totally fine here. I think we'll do that. Dude, house steward's so good. Imagine imagine having house steward get to me this late and and giving the clay sports guy house steward. Whoa, dude, look at all these miners. Oh my God, this, I, I understand what's going on. This person has the frickin', um, they have the, the, the uh, what is it called? They, ha they have the lantern house, they have the lantern house. They're lantern housing and they're doing this. This is pretty funny, I'm not gonna lie. Wow, forward got to me. I have to take forward here. Forward's so nutty, right? Forward's just completely insane. Yeah, I'm down. My food's gonna be a little weird, but it's gonna be fine. I mean, I can just—I'll just start player for for four nade here. I'll just start player four nade this next turn. Um, if it gets to me, and then that'll be my food and and allow me to play ox again. Yeah, that'll be good. And then we can plan on renoing around six. Oh, okay, that is the worst flip of all time. Every other flip was really good for us there. That flip is identically bad. Yeah, I'll just camp starting. I'm fine camping starting here. Camping starting is totally fine for me. Totally, totally fine. Oh, real life. Thank you for the follow. I greatly appreciate that. I will camp the heck out of starting player here. Dude, I got so much read in the future. We'd love to see it. Dude, rip that wood though. I can't believe that forward whip me a test. That's so insane. Uh-huh. Makes sense. I may actually have to build a fireplace here too. God, I could go reno fireplace. I go fireplace? I'm so tempted by this fireplace now. Why am I so tempted by the fireplace? It's because I need a ton of food. <laughs> I need so much food this game. My food situation is not good. Yeah, like I'm probably building a fireplace at some point. All right, never mind. Not yet. Build it later. Oh, I did something stupid. What did I do? Oh, okay. I just clicked a button. I clicked a button. That was not a good button to click. Uh, It's my turn, but I clicked a bad button. Let me get back to my chat. Um... Yeah, we're gonna camp starting here. I'm gonna camp starting. Um, mainly because I need to play Fornade, I need to play Clay Supports, I need to play so many things here. Um, yeah, we'll just play Fornade. I'll, I'll just get this out now. We'll just get it out now. It's super duper good. And then I will play a Frame Builder with my second action. Because that seems good to me. Um, and then, yeah, if I... So I can, like, start player Reno next turn if Reno flips. That's gonna be totally fine. If I play this frame builder, yeah, I can do that. That's actually pretty good. Yeah, I'm in on that. I love the name Dr. Bois. Oh my God, dude, cat, we're cattle breeding now? Or cattle whispering now? Dude. See, I think that like Alco's game could have been completely nuts here. I think they got sidetracked with all these fields. Like why do they have three fields in play right now? I, I think this is, I mean, if they have Carrot Museum, then good on them. Um, but if they don't have Carrot Museum, I think this is a little bit of a mistake. They do have Schnapps Distiller, but I mean, if they're not playing Schnapps Distiller first, I don't, I don't really understand the, the the diversion for the Cattle Whisperer here. I think it's a little bit of a mistake. Yeah, it's just time to camp starting. It's time to camp starting, ladies and gentlemen. It's that time of the day where we camp starting player. Um, I will play this Frame Builder because this Frame Builder is completely insane here, and I like it. Yeah, I need, I need a pottery here so bad. Ooh, we got it, let's go. Um, So we're gonna clay supports, I believe. I think clay supports the best thing to play. Yeah, clay supports gotta be good here. We will clay supports. 
and I'll, I'll rand clay later on. Not necessary to rand clay immediately. I will do it later. Oh my god, dude. Wait, I, I have five food. I have four wood, three clay, two stone, and one reed. That is incredibly satisfying. And I have zero points. <laughs> Even though it doesn't really mean much, we have zero points. Let's go. That is so satisfying. We got five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Yeah, we just need six veggie. Yeah, yeah. We need. Well, yeah, we need. We need seven grain, six veggie. Yeah, yeah. That's what we need. That's exactly what we need. That's what we need for sure. I gotta take wood here. I have to take wood with this action. I think I could also take clay hut builder. Clay hut builder is interesting. I need a clay action somewhere, hilariously. Is Skillful Renovator actually good? Skillful Renovator might actually be good. I, it gives me the clay that I need immediately. It's gonna give me three wood. Oh, it gives me more than three wood, actually, because I can reno next turn. Oh, but Kentinsky looks like he wants to reno. Oh, dude, Skillful Renovator might actually be good here. It, it might actually be a lot of wood um, to play at this turn. The problem is that both uh, okay, Kandinsky is never renoing here, right? There, there's no chance that Kandinsky renos. But he could... Th no, there's no chance. It's, it's not possible because he needs a stone oven here. There's got to be stone oven play. Weird starting. Really weird starting here. Um, This might be the only time Skillful Renovator is good. It, it actually is pretty insane here. Because I can go Skillful Renovator, Reno Pottery. I ha Then I have the one clay to eat. It gives me a bunch of wood when I reno, which then allows me to build rooms again. It seems pretty good here. It honestly seems good. That one clay is actually huge for me here, and it gives me a lot of wood when I reno, and then it gives me some wood later. I, I think that honestly it's going to be good enough here. The food situation in future turns is a little bit scary. Um, I'm, I am going to need to figure out a way to feed that. I mean, this is going to be okay for now. I need to figure out a way to get um, the uh, basket makers workshop at some point. At some point, I need to figure out how to get that. I don't. I don't really know how I'm going to get that yet, but we'll we'll figure out a way somehow. Yeah, I don't need a clay hut builder yet. I, I can clay hut builder in some time in the future here. Yep, oven. Okay, makes sense. Makes a lot of sense. Makes a ton of sense. Yeah, I actually think the Skillful Renovator gives me a ton of stuff here that I need, hilariously. Oh man, what am I doing next turn? I might get six wood next turn, which would be nutty. How many rooms do I build? Oh, I need read for rooms. <laughs> I take three stone. I go three stone, like... Three stone might be the thing that I do. I might go three stone, three read, reno next turn. That might be the thing that I do. Three, uh, three read I have to take. Three read is so insane for me. I think three stone I have to take two. Oh, what do I do? Yeah, I need the read so bad. The read is like so insane for me. The read is so nuts for me here. Hmm. I hope that someone else doesn't try and reno. If someone else tries to reno, I'm gonna be very upset. I'll be very not happy with, with everyone here. Yeah, my food situation is bad, but we will we will make the best out of it. I, I just need to angle for a BMW. BMW is going to be the way out here for me. It's going to be the way out of the food situation. Then we get a reed pond up and then pog. Yeah, do I take three reed or, th or three stone first? I, it's got to be the reed, right? Maybe I can do something else with the stone. Can I do anything else with the stone here? Not really. I mean, I could build joinery, I guess. I guess joinery is not too bad because I'm going to have a lot of wood. Joinery is not too bad. Yuck. Got so sad. <laughs> Got so sad all of a sudden. What happened? The read is so necessary, though. How do I how do I do things without the read this game? If I don't get BMW, I'm in such trouble. I guess I can build like a cooking hearth or something, but that seems bad. Hello there. Hello, thank you for the follow. Uh, it's today. I appreciate that. Cheap makes sense. Makes a lot of sense. There. Oh my God, the follows are coming in hot. The W Wubby, thank you for the follow. 
as opposed to the Wubby Dubby. Um, I can also take six wood here. Oh my gosh, dude, they're all coming in. Uh, the Epic Raffle, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that too. Uh, okay, taking the six wood. Okay, good for me because that means building is happening next turn. I I need the reed. God, I need everything here. I need, I need the reed, I need the stone. If I get the stone, I don't have to take the reed for BMW. The reed lets me build so many rooms though. I want to angle for a build next turn if possible. Mm, I go read Reedstone food into Reno. Yuck. Oh, what order? Oh, what order am I doing? I mean, I think that joinery might also not be bad. I just, I don't want to encourage other people to build rooms here. I really don't want to encourage other people to build rooms. Uh, encouraging other people to build rooms is going to be a way that I lose this game. I could play Stonecutter, maybe? The problem is that if I play Stonecutter, I'm going to starve. I think the read's more important here. No, but no, there's no way the stone gets back to me, though. Well, now I'm just tipping my hand. <laughs> yeah, I have ramped clay for fences. Ah, oh, dude. Shucks. Shucks, dude! Oh, man. Uh, I want to take it all. Okay, red is building that. I don't know what the heck green is doing. Green could do anything here. Oh, green's growing. Wait, green's growing? Then what is... Okay, so it's going grow, build. What is teal doing? Gotta be start player. Gotta be start player. No way they take this read. No chance they take the read here. They have to start player. They gotta take start player, right? They have to start player here. Yeah, they gotta start player. I think we're okay. I think we get both these actions here. I think we get both these actions. I, I may, maybe I miscounted, but the stone is the most important. The stone is the most important. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I definitely, I will definitely get to play it. I will definitely play ramp clay at some point. It'll happen at some point. I don't know when, but it'll happen at some point. I don't know when. Well, now I'm really sad I didn't take this freaking, um, what's it called? This clay pipe. I'm very sad about that now. Uh, yes, I'm playing pottery. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm playing pottery. Well, so, yeah, so I get the read and, and build them. Um, I mean, I was planning on building pottery anyways, but, like, I probably, though, if I get the read, I just build um, BMW here. But um, I do need the read. I need the read because um, BMW is so much food for me, and, and I really need that food. I need the food so bad here. There's the build. Then second action is going to be start player here. Yeah, the read is so important for me. Um, I may be pottery anyway. No way. I need the food so bad. I need the food outrageously bad here. It's so unreal. Stone cutter might be good here. Is, is that possible? I mean, I, I, I have to take the read now. Um, yeah, no one can run out. Pog, we get to run out too. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Ideally, we're building pottery and BMW and maybe joinery here. Ideally. Um, Stone cutter has to be insane this game, right? Maybe stone car is the nuts. Because I, I don't think I want to reno to stone, honestly. Um, which is sad, sad that we have this excavator in our hands of this freaking, um, you know, this other thing. But we got scooped, so that's a thing. We got totally hosed. This is going to be start player with... Uh, wow, not start player. Wow, that's craziness. You're just letting Dr. Bob build in front of you? What the heck? The heck is that? Uh, hang this. Do I build pottery here? If I build pottery, I get to build a room next turn. If I build pottery, I get to build a room next turn. Is that important to me to build a room next turn? It's pretty sweet. The problem is that my food situation can be really bad. I know it's very lonely here. <sighs> Yuck. Uh, which one do I build here?
Dude, I need everything here. I need the reed. I need the pottery. I need the BMW. I think that I need the, the food too bad. I think my food situation is a little bit too scuffed. I could just build the rooms later on. I, I'll just build the rooms later on, honestly. Like, it's not a big deal. Yeah, the, the, uh, the it's very close. It's very, very close. The, the Both of them have issues. Both of them have really, really big issues. Um... Like, like I want the the reed immediately to build a room. Like, like I'm probably playing this reed pawn. Like, I'm probably gonna go like start play a reed pawn next turn and try and sneak in and build a room here or something like that. I don't know. Um, I would like to cook my reed, please. I just need the food too bad. The food is a little bit scuffed here. I don't actually need that much clay, uh, that much stone to reno here. That's one nice thing. Uh, this this stone cutter would have been very good here if I could play it, but there's no chance I have a chance to play it. Um, I'm very tempted to take this clay here. If I go, go read stone food, build, this person is building no matter what, right? Is this person building no matter what? I can go read stone food, build? Or threaten build? Six clay is insane. I mean, I could just take six clay and take a freaking um... I could also bottom feed. God, I have so many options. I have to read stone food to threaten build here. Read stone food to threaten build is just so nuts. And the stone is really good for me because I can take joinery with it. I can take pottery with it. Um, I have to threaten to build here um, because if I get to build, it's pretty ridiculous, I think. I think being able to build here is pretty nuts. So we're going to threaten to build here. I think it's a little bit too good. And then we'll, we'll like figure out feeding later. I could bottom feed here. Is bottom feeding that bad? Doesn't look that bad to me, honestly. Okay, so green's gonna build. That's totally fine. That is acceptable. Yeah, the reed pond, I really wanna play at some point soon. I just don't have a good chance to play it. Farm store might actually be okay here. Do I take six clay? Six clay is so good. Six clay is so stupidly good too, though. Wow, not starting. That is craziness. That's craziness. You're just never going to get to build. I have to take six clay if it gets to me right. I just have no choice here. I have to build a major this turn. I really want to build a major this turn because the major competition looks kind of scuffed here. I don't really want to get blocked on major. Yeah, six clay is just so insane here. It's so nutty. How many rooms do I want to build? I want to build up to six, I think. I think six rooms is going to be ideal. No, I, I shouldn't build six. I should just build up to five. I, I shouldn't plan on building up to six here. I should plan on building up to five. Yeah, take more wood. Everyone wants to build more rooms, I guess. Um, I mean, I can't pass six clay. It gives me a cooking hearth if I need it. It gives me a, a, a thingy thing. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to take it. I'm not going to pass it up. It's so good. I can fence with it. I can fence, like, right now. And then we major minor with our next action. Major minor with the next action, because I need the I need a pottery or something like that really, really bad. And then next turn, I'll clay hut builder. Ah, fencing early. Interesting. Very, very interesting. This screams out big country to me. This screams big country, which would be pretty interesting to, to have a big country here. I'm very curious what green's doing. Gotta be big country. It's it's gotta be big country. I refuse to believe this is anything but big country here, which is honestly good for me because it means that they're not building again, which is going to make my builds later on a lot easier to get. Uh, yeah, my I can just bottom feed next turn. I can honestly just bottom feed whenever I need to here. Yeah, I, I think we're just gonna build this now. We're just gonna take the um, the pottery now. Yeah, pottery's gotta be quite good, right? Yeah, sure, we'll just do it now. We'll just do it now. I, I need the food really bad. Um, it helps me with my food. This feeds me for the next harvest, so I'm, I'm pretty in on it. I still need more reedstone food, hilariously. Reedstone food is just like the best action of, for me of all time, because I need the one reed really, really bad. Yeah, I guess I'm going to plan on not building anytime soon. I guess we're just going to try and build later on a little bit. I do need to take a two-read action at some point then to double build in one turn and not have to worry about it. 
Um, and then we'll read pawn for some extra points later on. But yeah, I, I need to double read in one turn to not have to worry about things. Or I could just read stone food a bunch too. Read stone food twice is also just like totally acceptable. I might build build a. I might actually build joinery this game too. Joinery actually is going to be nuts. Yeah. So next turn, what do I want to do? So next turn, I want to clay hat builder. I want a joinery, and I want to read stone food. I think those are the three actions that I really want to do next turn. And then we're going to like go read stone food into double build or something like that on the turn after that. We're going to play read pond on one family grow. We're going to ramp clay on another one, um, and then we should be like good on almost everything except for fields. And then we just need to plow really aggressively later on. Farm store might be good actually. Farm store might be pretty nuts here i just need to feed with all the the guilds feeding with the guilds is gonna be really important for me and like figuring out how to feed with all that i'm just gonna be on three family members for a while okay clay delivery man's interesting very late clay delivery man very very late um i cannot believe oh i guess i'll go starting next turn for the the growth that's pretty crazy to do. Because, like, I could just starting and then build. Which, should I do that? Starting read pond into build seems pretty nuts, actually. That might actually be better tempo-wise. Oh, I could starting farm store. Oh, my gosh. Wait, I could starting farm store. No, no, I need a read, though. I can't starting and build unless I take a read action. Interesting. Mmm. Very interesting. God, I have to play this Clayhead Builder this turn. I have to play this Clayhead Builder this turn. It's like way too good. It's way too good to play this this turn. I really want to play this Farm Store though. Yuck. I'm one read short of being able to do it all, unfortunately. One read short of being able to do it all. Wow, that's craziness. God, we're playing a Roof Baluster now. What the heck? What the heck? What is this? Why are we playing Roof Baluster now? How did Roof Baluster get to them fourth pick, by the way? That's craziness. Uh What the heck do I do now? I really wanted to play an Akir. Clay Hut Builder is so insane. Um, I need an extra read so I can build. Um otherwise I can't build. Uh because I have to eat a read at harvest, so yeah, I have to I have to build and, and do stuff with it. Mmm. Do I need the clay hut builder stuff? Yeah, I really do. I guess I can go five food into... I just want to double build. No, I need a double build. But I need, I need to feed with my clay here. Five food, ock. Question mark? Five food, ock, read stone food? Uh, five food, ock, two read. Yeah, five food, ock, two read here. That's what we're going to do. We're going to do five food, ock, two read. Um, yeah, let's do that. Five food, Oct two read here. Does the five food matter that much? Oh, could I actually... Wait, wait, Can I joinery instead? Is joinery better than, than Oct here? No, I should five food. Um, Farf store gives read. It's after feeding. Yeah, it's after feeding, unfortunately. Um, uh, yeah, because it doesn't work that way. Um, I mean, I could start player it, but it would replace the read and something else. Like, farm store is actually pretty good here. God, this game got so complicated. Hello, RNK. How are you? Oh, I got so complex. This is a very complicated turn. Because, yeah, I could farm store here. Oh, it's such a complicated turn. No, I have to clay out builder. Clay out builder is too good. It's 10 fence pieces. I, I'm obligated to 10 clay out builder. Clay out builder is like way too good here. It's 10 fence pieces. It's like so insane. The question is, how do I feed this turn? What's the best way of feeding? <laughs> the RARs have have arrived. Oh, two, seven. All right. I think it's more efficient. Are you? Okay, cool. Oh, uh, this hurts so bad to do. I'm going to joinery here.
I might be doing my math wrong. I could bottom feed. Joinery is just so efficient. Like the thing about joinery is that it's super duper efficient here. It's so stupidly efficient. Um, like, like, cause now I have seven food every harvest. I want to play this farm store actually. Yeah, like it's very tempting. Yeah, the problem is that my read count is effed. So I want to go to read into lessons here. I think that's my play is to read into lessons. Dr. Boy is going to reno. Is this reno? What is Dr. Boy doing? I don't know what Red's doing. Yeah, like, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. This is like a, a game of inches right now that I'm playing. I'm really trying to inch out like every single advantage that I can get here um, because I'm, I'm like low on action. So I'm really just trying to play really tight here. I think to read Auk is going to be the play. Yeah, we're going to go to read Auk here. I have to play Clay Hot Builder. I must play Clay Hot Builder this turn. So yeah, I'll, I'll go Auk, and then if two reads there, I'll do that. Um, yeah, joinery is food, it's points. Um, it's efficient food. Like, that's the important thing is that we have a lot of ways to get wood. Like, I can farm store some wood and some other things. Like, I, I think it's going to be good here. Maybe farm store is bad here, actually. But I, I think it's efficient given what we have going on. Makes excavator not terrible either. Like, it makes excavator like freaking a million points. But I think that our axes are efficient enough that joinery is good here. Like, we, we're gonna have so many resources. Like, resources is the one thing that we have a million of. The one thing that we don't have a million of is, is food. Like, we have a lot of resources. We have to find a way to convert that into something. I think that's the way to convert it into something here. All right, so we're going to Auk and to read in some order here. I think I'm going to go to read first. Yeah, let's just to read first. To read then Auk. Yeah, I think it's very unlikely. I mean, this guy could take Auk, though. That's the problem. Yeah, I'll just Auk here. No one's taking to read. No way. Clay a builder. All right, get in there. Get in there, buddy. Too important to play this here. Way too important to play this here. I might I might take a bottom feeding action at some point, but I, I just like can't take it immediately. I got I gotta take it at some point, but I just can't take it now. And then we will family growth reed pond, family growth rammed clay at some point. Um alright, you get to grow now. Uh-huh. This is gonna be start player for a um big country, because that's the only thing that makes sense. Man, no minor. That's rough. This milk jug's gonna bail me out a little bit. That extra food's actually gonna be huge for me. It's going to be absolutely massive. Mm -hmm. Please take an animal space, Red. That's not an animal space. <laughs> That's not animal space. No, dude, they want to run out of stone for something. I guess they have a bunch of stone cards. No, they just wanted a well. All right, cool. That's fair enough. They wanted a well. They just wanted their well, okay? They just wanted their well. Um, I will take this two read actions. Two read actions nuts. It lets us double build here um, in this next turn. Which we will do. Yeah, the double building guarantees us a growth here. Unfortunately, I'm going to be short a reed. I could take reedstone food, I guess. I don't know. We'll find something to do. Yeah, we got double build. Do I double build with... Oh, I got double build in wood, actually. Double building in wood makes too much sense. Like, uh, yeah, it makes too much sense here. And I'll just take a wood action at some point. I'll just take a wood action at some point. It'll be fine. So what are we doing next turn? So next turn we're taking a either a wood action or just a bottom feed. A six food action is actually just like completely insane for us. I might actually just take a six food action first next turn, and then I might go like six six food, double build, and then like who knows what. Who knows what after that? Um, I would like to feed with all my guilds, please. Thank you very much. Give me my guild monies. We're definitely going to be fencing big here. This is going to be a huge pasture that we're building because we have like... Oh, actually, it's not going to be that big because we have... we're going to be building a lot of rooms here. Yeah, we're going to be building two more rooms. Building two more rooms is super free. Do I build in wood? I might build one room in clay to keep some wood around. Keeping some wood around is really nice because it means that we don't have to... Uh... Like, we don't have to take a wood action to feed with the joinery here, and I think that's going to be important for me. But 
but yeah, because I have so many resources available to me, I think all the guilds are pretty decent. Okay, we got animal space. Um, four woods, very tempting. Six food is just completely insane. I mean, six food is just completely nuts. I don't really think I can get better than six food here. Like, how is everyone else feeding? Okay, so green has this, this baking combo, but this is about to run out of food. This is not going to be that good. This is animal feeding. This food is going to be fine for a little bit, but it's going to run out soon. I think six food's so good. Like six food plow build rooms, six food wood build rooms. Both those are really good. Yeah, and I just keep some wood around for the future. Yeah. All right, that seems fine. It's, it's so good. It's like so much food here. It just takes care of me for too long. It's just like a little bit too good here to, to get this food. It's a little bit too ridiculous. Yep. Yeah, I'm not going to build more than five rooms here. And hopefully we can get the stone to reno to stone at some point. Renoing to stone at some point would be nuts. Because, like, this this skillful renovator might actually be really... It's actually going to turn out to be really good. Oh, no! Truffle slicer! No, dude, the wood. Rip the wood. F's in chat for the wood. Wood's going to go bye-bye. Okay, there's a six food. That makes sense. Six food's very good here. Oh, I think I have to plow a field. I think... I think I have to plow a field here. I think plowing a field is a little bit too insane. Um, so I plow a field. Yeah, I, there, I I need to plow so many fields here. Like fields are like so ridiculous in terms of points. I think that they're too good for me here. I go plow a field and then build. Yeah, it seems fine. Plow here. Yes. Boom. And then I will build. Yeah, I, I definitely need to plow. Yeah, I 100% need to plow. I agree. Yeah, the Fornade. Fornade's messing me up a little bit, but, like, it's not going to be too bad. Oh, we're going to have so many resources at the end of this game. So many resources. The building lined up, though. I think the building's going to line up really, really well. But, yeah, I'm going to build one room in clay. I'm going to burn a resource here to just make sure that I have wood to feed with, because that's my main feeding. I just want to make sure that I'm fine with that. Um, and I'll probably take a reed action of some... Like, reedstone food has got to be really good for me. Reedstone food's got to be really, really good just to make sure that I have the reed that I need to feed. And then we're going to go read pawn on one family growth ramp clan, the other F poor farm store farm farm stores is not getting there, unfortunately. But yeah, this feels so good for us. Feels so good. This game's going pretty well. I'm actually pretty happy with how this game is going. It, it's going pretty well. I'm not I'm not too unhappy about it. Like the fence pressure is going to be a little rough, but it, it's not going to be too bad. I don't think all the wood actions got taken. That's fine because we have ramp clay and ramp clay is nuts. Um, I will build a bunch of rooms. Build rooms. This this. Um, just two. Wait, why is it why does it say four rooms? Oh my god, chat, I'm so freaking dumb. I'm actually the dumbest of all time. I forgot that clay supports reduces the amount of clay on on um rooms. I completely or the amount of reed. I completely forgot that it reduces the amount of reed on rooms. That is really dumb. Um I was like, why does it say four rooms? That doesn't make any freaking sense. Well, in that case... Oh, and it, uh, dude, I, I did so much math wrong there. All right, I'm going to build three rooms. Wait, I, I would like to build three rooms here. I changed my mind. I want three rooms. I lied. <laughs> I lied. I want three rooms here. I would like three rooms here, please. I think three is the right number. Uh, let's let's build three rooms here. I, I forgot that I have extra read. I need one extra read to feed, and then I'll be okay. Um, I will keep one wood around. That seems very reasonable to me as well. Am I burning too much reed here? Or for too much um, clay? No, I'm fine. I'll be fine here, right? Oh, maybe I do only want to build this. Shoot, dude. Shoot, dude! Yeah, I need to save my clay here. I need to save my clay. I got to save my clay here, unfortunately. I'll, I'll just take like a wood action of some kind. Yeah, this is fine. I, I think using this for, for this is fine. Yeah, I I, I miscounted my, my... Like, I forgot that clay supports discounts my read. I just completely forgot about that. Dumb, dumb Sean. I was like, oh yeah, I need so much read to build. I Could I have built last turn? Am I dumb? I probably missed a build somewhere. I, I like literally just forgot how, how um, cards work. <laughs> 
I literally forgot how cards work here. I, I just literally forgot how my cards work. That's super funny. God, there's gonna be five sheep. That's so nuts. That's actually insane. I need to take, yeah, so like next turn I'm taking plow. I'm taking like maybe a wood action, but who knows? I actually need a wood action here if I want to reno to stone, and then I'm just going to slam stone actions whenever I can get my hands on them. It's like slamming clay, like stone is okay, but I need a field. I just need, I just need four stone here to reno to stone. I don't actually need that much stone. Just four stone to round to stone. That's not that bad. All right, I think everything's going okay. Uh, yeah, the sixth room is fine. That's a little bit of a punt on my part to <laughs> mess this up, but that's okay. Just do not care about animals at all right now. I guess I get stone cutter for an extra stone. It's kind of lame. I have to do that. Yeah, and we should have a lot of food. I do need a three wood action next round if I get it, but uh, six clay is very good. How much clay do I have? I guess I have a lot of clay. I guess six clay is just completely insane. Six clay has got to be nuts. Gotta be super nuts here, and then we'll just eat reed and clay and stuff forever. I'm very tempted to take three wood with my first action next round. I think, uh, well, that's not gonna happen, maybe. <laughs> Might take two wood then, because two wood is like two food and two stone. I guess I don't have to take wood for next harvest. I guess I don't have to eat wood next harvest. It just would be nice. It would be nice to eat wood. Eating wood, so fun. Oh my god, dude, this food from the freaking milk jug is gonna be great for us. It's gonna be so nice. Oh, it's gonna be so juicy. It's gonna be outrageously juicy. Yeah, I need to plow aggressively. So, okay, so what do we need? We need the clay action is gonna be nuts. The plow action is gonna be nuts. Um, And then we need to family grow. And we have plenty of food for this. For now. For now, we have plenty of food. We're, we're gonna be struggling on food in just a little bit, but that's okay. We'll figure it out. I, I probably do need to take a two wood action just to make sure that I have enough wood for feeding because it's essentially a four food action. Whoa, taking the sheep. I like that a lot. That is really nice. I might take the three wood action, dude, with my first. I'm, I'm thinking about taking the three food action or three wood action, honestly. I'm thinking very hard about it because like I don't think the clay gets taken. Maybe it does. Who takes the clay here? I mean, only only Teal would take the clay. All right, they're going to take the wood. That makes sense. They have Truffle Digger. That makes a lot of sense here. Unfortunate. I, I really would like a wood here. Is Excavator good? There's no way, right? Oh my god, Star Player, let's go. Well, that means I got to take the clay here. Got to take the clay, and then I will we'll sack two food here. And if I get a wood action, I'll take a wood action. I'll be fine. Oh, Last Patch is so good. What a good card that is. Yeah, let's take six clay with the intention of fencing at some point in the near future. Like, I can fence next turn if I really need to. How tight am I fencing? That's a that's a very legitimate question that I have for myself, is how tight am I fencing? Missing a plow is fine here. I'm okay with missing one plow. I, I might fence pretty... Like, I'm going to fence so that I can plow three spaces. I think that's the optimal way to fence here. What am I doing with this next action? Maybe I take one cow? Cow's pretty good. I mean, I need animals. I could take a veggie too and just sow stuff. Yeah, I don't know what my last action is gonna be. Two wood is honestly very tempting. It's food for me. It's like the wood that I need for my reno later on. Um, it's very, very tempting. I need the food real. The food is actually a very big concern of mine. I'm, I'm very concerned about food because like feeding with guilds only goes so far, unfortunately. Like feeding with guilds can only go so far. It's very unfortunate. That's just how it is. I do feel like I have to run out of stone because it's so good for me to do so. Yeah, I mean, I'll just take three clay or three stone with one of my first actions next turn. I guess I could plow a field once. Pl I, the plows are really monk s here. The plows are very, very sketchy. Yeah, I think I am taking two wood, unfortunately. Education bonus, getting used. Ooh, fodder planter, that's fun. Fodder planter's a really good one here. Getting a veggie to sow, that's really nice. Yeah, this sucks really bad, but I... Do I have to run out of stone? How many actions am I taking to run out of stone? So it's one, two... 
three, four actions to run out of stone, and it's only six points. It's so bad. Maybe I'm not running to stone here unless I get a four stone action. Running to stone is just not great for me then. Then what am I doing? Like cow? Cow into fence 13? Yeah, we'll take a cow here. Taking a cow here is good. I need a little bit of extra food, um, and this is totally fine. Yeah, let's take a cow here. Cow's fine. We'll do we'll do cow. We'll do a little cow action. I feel like the animals are gonna be like very contended for in the near future. Cow is two points for Alco here, so like it seems pretty good to take a cow. Might as well take it. And then with our last action, we'll grow and play a reed pond. Yay! And I might I might grow early next turn just so I can fence with my ramp clay. Um just to make sure that I get that. It's gonna be very important to get a very early on next turn. I probably have to take four wood with my first action, actually. If if I get a chance for four wood, I probably have to take it. I have to go like four wood, um family grow ramped clay. Fence if I get it, but if not, I'm taking plows or crops or something like that. I don't need that many plows. Like, like one plow would be nice if I got one one more plow in there. That would be cool, but I, I, I don't expect to get that many more plows here. I guess I can build a seventh room. <laughs> How good's building a seventh room? How good is that? God, Ramp Clay with Clay Hut Builder is so juicy. Ramp Clay, Clay Hut Builder is like the juiciest thing of all time. It's such a nice combo. Yeah, and this is the part where Fornade's gonna kind of bite me a little bit, but that's okay. I really don't think I care about stone at all. I really don't think I care about stone unless I get identically four. I think if I get identically four stone, it's gonna be a big deal because it's too it's too scary otherwise to try and reno. Because it's like four actions for six points, which is really bad. And I think I can do better by just fencing and taking animals and, and sowing and plowing and things like that. Like, I think that's just better. Maybe I plow with my first action. Maybe plowing's a little better. Ooh, I have more water, let's go. Wood, God, dude, these late wood barters are so sad. Is this for building rooms? Is this guy really gonna build a fifth room? Or is this just for fences? This is, the, this is the most sketch wood barter of all time. Why are we playing this here? Why are we playing a wood barter here? I don't understand. This doesn't make sense. This makes very little sense. Oh, I'm growing my family. Don't worry. I'm growing it this turn. I, I just, I'm growing it. Uh, it's happening. It's happening with my last action, though, because no one else can family grow this turn. So we're playing with our last action. Yeah, I'm gonna family grow reed pond. Um, but yeah, next turn. So next turn, I will grow my family. But yeah, I'm gonna like plow a field, take, like, I, I want to family grow ram clay and then fence. I think that's gonna be my play there. I do need to fence fairly early. I hope someone fences this turn. I, I. <sighs> should I play the ramp clay now? Maybe I should play the ramp clay now. I, I'm, I'm actually gonna play the ramp clay now. And the reason for that is that I wanna, I, I'm fine giving up one reed because I have enough reed in the future to be fine. I'm fine giving up the reed so that way I get a guaranteed fence action next turn. I'm totally fine with that. I'm completely on board with giving up a reed so I get a guaranteed fence action. This fence is pretty dirty from uh, Teal here. Pretty dirty fence action. Yeah, I think I actually am playing Rand Clay here. Very unfortunate that I have to do it this way, but them's the breaks. It, fencing is just so good. Fencing is so good. Getting, like, two pigs on, on this would be completely insane. Um, it's so good here. Like, I, I only have one space I can fence on, so, like, it's really important that I fence uh, early on. Really, really important that I fence, because I can't reno fence. If I could reno fence, I would definitely not be worried about fences, but... Yeah, Ramp Clay Baron now. Yeah, yeah, Ramp Clay Baron now is, is is definitely agreeable. I think I agree with that. It's definitely Baron now because I can fence 13, fence moderately big, and be totally fine with it. Yeah, I, I think it's going to be very good to do. And then we'll just eat clay and it'll be great. I guess I could fence 14, actually. Maybe fencing 14 is better. Maybe, yeah, fencing 14 seems a little bit better to me because I'll probably take a clay with, with one of my last actions at some point. Like, I'll probably take a clay somewhere. We'll just deal with it. <laughs> My food is going to be a little... How much food do I have right now? So I have eight food. 13. 18. 23 food. I need... Uh, I need 27 food. 
So yeah, so I'll get two from Clay Hut Builder. Yeah, yeah, so I have 14. Yeah, yeah, so I'll have 14, which is good. 14 is a good number. So I could fence 14. It's kind of close between fencing 14 and fencing 13, honestly. It's very close. I think fencing 13 is a little bit better. Ah, fencing 14 is better because it gives you more animal capacity. I, I think the animal capacity is actually going to be necessary. Although Alco's not, Al Alco's going to snap the sheep up. I don't, I don't think that I get the sheep very, like, I don't think I'm going to get two sheep. If I get two sheep, then it's, it's a punt to do this, but improvements interesting very interesting this gotta be for a cooking hearth there's no way it's not for a cooking hearth i'm surprised they're not so oh they already can sew yeah that was a little surprising this is for a fence piece presumably um okay, i guess i'll grow my family and play ramp clay very cool yeah we'll just do this here Why not? Yeah, Reed Pond's gonna be worth exactly a point here if I do it this way, which is fine. We don't have an extra clay to reno, but honestly, renoing seems like not quite in the question anyways. Um, if Dr. Bois fences on me here, I'm gonna have a little bit of a dilemma, but I don't think they should fence. They should be they should be plow sowing or or, um, or family growing because they can fence later on. It's not a huge deal at all for them. Like for me, it's a huge deal for me. Like I probably have to start player defense here if I don't get it which is really sad. Uh, I could probably, I could try and play farm store maybe. Maybe farm store is better. If I start player for fence, I can build 15 fences, which is cool. It's very neat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like I think Dr. Bois doesn't need to fence immediately. They can just run a fence here. And reno fencing is just like a lot better for them. But I, I, I don't know. If I get blocked on fence, I'm gonna be very sad about it. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Alco can't fence anymore. Maybe I'm fine if I don't get fenced this turn. I'll just plow instead, I guess. Plowing is also a million points for me. Cook all the things. Cook them all. We have cooked all of our building resources into stuff. We're gonna be good on food for now. We're not gonna be good on food for later. Yeah, like they should be plowing or plow sowing or, or something like that. Like I do need one more field. The field is very scary situation. Fields are very scary situation here, but I, I, the fence is too important for me. But yeah, plow sow flips, like they should be taking plow sow. If family growth flips, they should be taking family growth. Like I can't imagine that they don't do it, but whatever, I could just be wrong. I could just be wrong. I might fence 14. I'm still thinking about it. Fence 14 seems fine. Yeah, that seems fine to me. I'm fine with it. Problem is that Alco's gonna take all my clay and I'm gonna not have clay for things. Although I could get I could get six clay in the last round. That's probably fine. Like they sh should be plow sowing, I think. I think they should be plow sowing here. God, they ate their veggie. Oh no, they sowed their veggie. Okay, they sowed their veggie. I still think they should be plow sowing here. But I mean, they could fence. Like the problem is that they could just line up a rent fence later. I don't know. Or maybe rent fence is kind of monk s. They fence. What do I do? They could just take four wooden, build fifteen fences. That's also better for them. I don't know. They have so much time to fence. Everyone has so much time to fence except for me. I don't have time to fence. I ain't got the time because I only have one spot I can fence on. Everyone else can reno fence. I can't. I gotta prioritize it more. It's very sad. Please, dude. Please let this fence happen. If it doesn't happen to me, so sad. <laughs> they won't fence, don't worry. I don't know, dude. I don't know, man. They're thinking. They're thinking really hard. I wish Family Growth flips so that way I didn't have to worry about it. If Family Growth flipped, I think they Family Grow guaranteed. But uh, Plowso is so good for them. How do you not Plowso? It's, it's like a bunch of grain. You need the grain anyways for your, your stuff. Like, you get to harvest and then re-sow it later on. Like, it's so good. It's so, so good to do. All right, give me my fence action. All right, we did it. Pog. Pog, we did it. We get to Pog. Um, give me these fences, please. I will leave exactly two spaces left because I don't believe in these two spaces. Uh, to, like, these, this is the most that could possibly get taken. I don't believe in myself to get a plow this turn. So yeah, I'll fence. Yeah, I'll fence. What about it? And then I would like the two pigs on the wheel. Two pigs are, or actually I'd like the plow on the wheel, but I'm, I'm not optimistic about getting the plow. So I would like two pigs instead, please. Please and thank you. 
and then we're gonna pray that there's four stone around next turn and if there's not four stone around then like i don't know what the heck i'm doing with with like i don't, I don't think i can reno but maybe we'll see i don't know all right there's wood for fences that makes a lot of sense oh my god dude are we wheeling plow are we wheeling plow is that real life if we wheel plow that's freaking poggers if we wheel plow that's nutty God, this wood barter is so sad. This is the most sad wood barter of all time for them to play because, like, it's so late in the game. Like, it's so, so late. I'm very curious to see who's going to win. I think we're, we feel... It feels like we're good here. Feels like we're good. The bet's at, like, exactly my win rate. Like, my win rate's, like, 50% about taking three stone. Okay. I guess Dr. Blob might want three stone. I just don't need to round a stone. I could build another room in clay. Like, that's better for me than building, <laughs> building a stone room. It's so much more efficient. Like, it's so not efficient to build uh, stone rooms here. Although building clay sucks too. Building clay is not efficient at all. It's very inefficient. Wow. Uh, I mean, God, they have a cooking hearth though. This person has a cooking hearth. That, that worries me a little bit. I mean, I have to plow here, right? I, I like, am obligated to plow here. Plowing here is, like, so good. I mean, getting a sow would be insane. Just too good. I mean, I, I just, like, can't believe other people aren't plowing here. I'll, I, I will hope that two boars makes it back. If it doesn't, then whatever. It's fine. And if it doesn't, it's fine. I'll take a cow instead. Cow, cow is the same, or it's less points than two boards. Uh, yeah, see, not renoing here is fine. Like, not renoing here is totally fine. Like, it is efficient for me to reno, but, like, it's a lot of actions for, for very little value in terms of the value I'm getting out of the reno here. So I'm, I'm pretty happy not renoing. I'm very happy with it. My game's going to be pretty good, honestly. Like, if I get these boards especially, my game's going to have been pretty good. All right, you have the conservator. Wow, that's crazy. So green picked out of that pack. Green was it, the stone carver got picked immediately out of that pack. <laughs> Dang, dude, we got rolled. We got absolutely rolled. We had no shot of getting the stone carver. That's so sad. Dude, rip stone carver. We tried so hard. Yo, starting player gang taken. Let's go, dude. Let's actually go. We love to see that. No way. No way. No way they're stream sniping. No chance. I mean, if they're stream sniping, then we're good on them. But I, I don't ever assume anyone's stream sniping. I never assume anyone's stream sniping. If you're if you're petty enough to stream snipe a random Agricola game, then like be my guest. <laughs> I don't assume anyone's ever stream sniping. I, I just don't make that assumption about people. I, I assume the best in people, not the worst in people, uh, t typically. But like, so I, I just, I'm, I'm never going to throw out accusations of stream sniping unless like something very peculiar would have to happen for me to throw that out. Like something very strange would have to happen for me to throw that out, which like it could to be fair like it could definitely happen where like you know if if someone's like uh they're thinking about a move and i'm like like oh man good thing that this move is unblockable for me and then they do that move like then i would be a sketch <laughs> that'd be a little sketchy but i don't think that's possible for that to happen all right so so everyone's gonna round a stone it looks like it looks like every single person in the game wants to round a stone except for me smile um, I can just take a cow next turn, right? Why can't I take a cow next turn? I, I don't think taking a cow over growing is right because like I have every guild. I have every single guild. So every single action that gives me resources worth points. Like the, the one good thing about having all the guilds that's really nice is that you are very unpoint capped with all the guilds. Like, like the one nice thing about guilds is that they, they unpoint cap you super hard because like every resource grab that you get is basically worth a point. I mean, like if you get a three wood, it's worth a point. If you get two wood, it's worth a point. Like every single resource grab that you get at the end of the game is going to be worth the point so like you're i'm pretty uncapped here and like actions are every action is essentially going to be worth a point because i'm always going to have some point somewhere that i can get so because of that it, it's very unlikely that we're point capped here like it's just so incredibly unlikely that we're capped enough to take a cow like i might take a cow next turn pretty early but um yeah we'll get a point from reed pond also by the way it's so sad that they took a, a point away from this so yeah it also gets us an extra read from reed pond so yeah I, I wouldn't consider taking a cow over growth here unfortunately um but i I mean, it's it's something that's worth considering in some games but yeah not in this one because like the food situation is fine for me i can take a food action some other time it's not gonna be an issue it does save me one food to to not grow here <laughs> which is not very much so 
I do want to take a wood action next turn. I, I, maybe six wood's worth it next turn because I can like it's two points and a f and, a, and two food, which is pretty ridiculous. So I have six food right now. I'm gonna be at sixteen. If I take a two wood action, that's twenty food, and that's enough for the rest of the game. No, the sheep, dude. The sheep, though. Uh, whatever. I'll grow. It's fine. The sheepy. I want my sheepy back. Yeah, I'll probably take a wood action next turn just to, to make sure I can feed with it. The wood action covers my feeding and makes it more likely that I can get points for things. So we'll just take a wood action next turn. So yeah, next turn is going to be like plow if I get it. Wood action if I get it. Cow if I get it. Rip sheep. <laughs> All right. See you, wood. I'll miss you. I'll miss you, wood. Oh, we're going to get a plow next turn. Let's go. Uh, they did. Yeah, they took a single sheep, which is uh, interesting. I mean, yeah, Teal's game is not terrible here. Like, they have a lot of points for things. Like, their, their point situation is pretty good. Um, I mean, cow, well, cow is two points. Cow, cow here is two points here, exactly. Oh, God, but there's two cows here. Yuck, dude, there's two cows here. Um, uh, the problem is that, so, yeah, so two cows is pretty nutty for someone else. What do I do here? I don't actually know what I'm doing here. I could take cow. I mean, cows are, are so, oh, teal, yeah. Cows are worth a bunch of points for teal too. I mean, I might take it just to block teal on it. Cow. I like my pile, by the way. It's like a little reed sandwich, like with clay in the middle. <laughs> Uh oh yeah, Teal has a whisper cow. No, but that doesn't. Oh, they do have a whisper cow. I see. Yeah, it's a graphical glitch. Yeah, they have a they have a the whisper cow. I need to see that. Thank you for noticing. I didn't. I literally didn't even notice because the graphical glitch. Yeah, they they have an extra cow in there. I didn't even notice. Um. Oh, but the, the, whatever. It's never gonna wheel because of this. All right, we're taking two cows. It's never gonna wheel because of red fencing. Never gonna wheel. Yeah, they, they, it looks good. I agree. It looks good here. All of our cows get to be in the same pasture. Chat, the cows have officially come home, by the way. So this is going to be our last game. <laughs> the cows came home. It's it, it's another reason to do it. Yeah, moo. Cows came home. Officially, it's going to be our last game. I need to do more gambles on games. The gambling on the games is very fun. The gamba is super fun. I need to do more gamba on games. It's very fun. Adds more excitement. So if Plowfield here wheels here, which it should wheel actually, Plowfield should wheel, we will take that for sure. Do I want to try and sew? I need a wood action. They let they did lay left the home for the pasture. It's true. Okay, what am I doing here? I'm taking like plow, veggie, wood. Something, something like reeds. I can't get blocked on reeds. Something like that. The, the reed getting blocked would be very disappointing, and it could definitely happen. I think that uh, green could take the reed here, which would be very unfortunate. Can I ever reno to stone? Ooh, layabout. That seems not good here. <laughs> layabout seems very not good here. That seems very not good. Um. Well, maybe it's okay. You don't get. It costs a point because you don't get to breed the cows. It costs a point for the cows because you don't get to breed the cows because of layabout because layabout skips your harvest. So therefore, you don't get to breed the cows. Um, you do get a million veggies. I guess their food sucks. What happened to their food? Why is their food so bad this game? What happened? They have no feeding engine at all. They just had big country and that's it. Which to be fair, big country is a ton of food. So it's pretty good. Yeah, we're just gonna leave the resource stacks till next turn. There's gonna be so much clay and other stuff here that I'm not really worried about it. The clay stacks I'm really not worried about. The wood stacks I'm a little bit more worried about. Um, yeah, they don't have anything. They have no, they didn't get the schnapps distiller, which is floating around the draft. Um, I, I don't remember if there's a schnapps distillery, but presumably they don't have that because that would be pretty crazy to, to have that and not have played it by now. Um, by playing excavator, that sounds risky. That sounds really risky. Are there even any majors I could play here? No, there's no way it's worth it. There's no chance. There, there's no way because both 
Kandinsky and a uh, Teal want a Reno, and like I can get blocked so hard on it by just like someone deciding they want Major Minor as offenses. Like, there's no way. I'm not gonna go for it. I, I have too many other point actions that are available on the board to consider going for it. I have way too many other actions to, to consider going for it here. Um, I should probably take one. Oh, do I take one sheep here? One sheep and two sheep are the exact same. I, I should take a veggie here. Veggie is going to be important because Kandinsky doesn't have a veggie here. Oh, I need to plow. Yeah, I got to plow here. I got to plow. Plowing is too important. Plowing is definitely the most important thing because plowing may not ever get back to me if I if I miss it at some point. So I, I just have to plow here. Yeah, you can plow. So it's funny how like with uh with freaking Fornade in play, you just look like an idiot. Like, oh, why didn't you plow? So <laughs> like, well. I cannot. <laughs> as much as I want to, I can't. And it's very lame. Yeah, and then the last round, we're just going to take a million resource acts. Dude, where is my uh, my card that lets you gather all the resources off the board at the end of the game? That card would be cool. Although, I'll, that card probably isn't even worth that many points here. So, what we're doing. We're doing sheep, veggie, grain. Do I need a wood action here? So, 7, 14, 17? Or se 17. So, I have 17 food. I need a, I need two more food, and then I'm good. Need exactly two more food here. Could play farm store. Transactor, yes, transactor. Yeah, I wish I had transactor here. If I had transactor here, life would be so good. All right, that's good. I like to see that. Sculpture, sculpture, not too bad with big country. Um, I gotta take a veggie. Yeah, it's like veggie. I need a wood action. A wood action's pretty good for me here. Uh, th the three wood action's good because it makes a four wood two points after that. So it feeds me and it makes a four wood action two points. So that's gonna be good. Ooh, sheepwalker. Okay, good. Um, that means that I should probably take the sheep here, huh? Oh, it gets a field too. That's pretty good. Oh, uh, I need, okay, so three wood has to be taken this turn. Gotta take a three wood action. Other than that, veggie sheep. Yeah, gotta be veggie. Gotta be veggie here, because this guy doesn't have veggie, and that concerns me very greatly. Gotta be a veggie here. Veggie sheep three wood, and then next turn we go like all the resource stacks in the world. Maybe I sow next turn. Yeah, next turn. Is grain contested? God, grain might be contested too. Freaking Alco doesn't have a grain. Alco not having a grain is very annoying. Maybe they have an Auk that gives them a grain. Although, I don't know what that would do, because it's essentially like a free awk, I guess, because they can convert the veggie into food, but yeah, that doesn't seem great. I wonder what they start playered for. wonder, uh, this gotta be for Plasso, right? I mean, they have like no food here, so it's gotta be for Plasso. Yeah, this trouble slicer looks pretty bad when you have no way to convert your your freaking animals or anything into food. Looks not great there. I read some of it. Thank you for not blocking my read. I so greatly appreciate that. Yeah, there, there's no way they're sniping. If they if they if they switch to blocking my read now, I'm gonna be sad. <laughs> then they're sniping me. Kappa. Poor skillful renovator. Unfortunately, renoing to stone would have been really good, but it, it's fine. We don't need it. I think my score is gonna be fine here. I think the score is gonna be good. This is gonna be a good score. We we have like high point. No, my read. Oh, this is for our hearth. Okay, this is fine. The, or, this is totally fine. My clay. I meant to say. Um, three wood, sheep. Yeah, I just take a sheep here. Sheep is too important. Oh, I could take a grain, actually. Grain is maybe more contested than sheep, although this this guy wants sheep really bad now. Yeah, grain seems pretty nuts here. I mean, the problem is that this guy could take a grain on me, and then that would be sucky. Yeah, I'll take a grain. We'll do grain, three wood. Grain three wood's fine, and the next turn we go sheep, resource, 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 something like that. No, my wood! My wood, dude, I need that for food. Seven, 17, 18. I need exactly two food. I mean, it's gotta be wood, right? It just has to be wood. Wood's like the best two food action of all time. I mean, I could sheep. I could sheep and, and monk ass on your doubt. Yeah, I think we got this. Um, 
Yeah, forward, forward next round's better. I agree. I agree with that. I was thinking that too, that that's probably better. Um, Cause yeah, cow's always getting taken by this person. Yeah, we'll take a sheep here. That's fine. Um, 12, 17, 18. I just wanna make sure I'm counting the food right. I think I am, that's good. So yeah, we should be fine. As long as we don't need to play an awk, which we do not, we'll be good. So yeah, we can go forward, forward. Um, yeah, even forward three wood is just the same. So we can literally just do the same thing next round and be totally fine here. All right, which resource stacks are going to be the mo the hardest to get? Yeah, what? Do, what do I do this turn outside of taking resource stacks? I guess it's like take a veggie because then it turns so into two points. Forward, forward, reed, clay, who knows what else. Uh, I get a food when someone takes a cow because of the milk jug. So there's that. Yeah, I'm counting milk jug. The jug. Chug jug with you. <laughs> Truly is a cow's paradise here today. If I need another food, I could just like sow instead. Although sow is definitely not getting to me. There's no way. No chance sow gets to me here. What order do I take actions in? The order is kind of wonky. Yes, this reorganization is good. Yes, please. I guess one animal's worth a point too. Is anyone taking my wood on me? I, I might take four wood by my first action. I think four wood is actually the, the action that's most likely to get taken. I have 50 million one point actions here. Like a cow, a... <laughs> sorry about that. sorry about that a cow a veggie and a boar and a sow are all worth a point to me so all those things are worth a point i guess i fenced wrong so i think i think four wood is honestly like the action that's most likely to get taken is four wood because i want i want four wood four wood six clay five reed and then some other point action i don't know what the other point action is but something Charcoal burner getting in there. I, I will say I've done a very good job this game of not contributing to the charcoal burner, which is great. Love to see that. This has got to be Plasso, maybe? No? Oh, they sewed with a fodder planter. That's very cool. It should still be Plasso, maybe. Oh, maybe it's it's uh, Family Growth That Room. How many Family Rooms do they have? They have three. It should be Family Growth That Room, then. It's hard to, to see once, once the board gets too big. Hard to see once the board gets to it. I do think forward's gonna be the most contested action, hilariously. And two forward actions is just way better for me than, than not two forward actions. Like if I take a forward action and the other forward gets taken, then I'm gonna be a little sad about it, but I I'll just take a one, a one point action instead. Yeah, we'll just do that instead. Yeah, I don't think there's any world in which the clay gets taken before, like, very late into the round. So, yeah, we'll just start with four wood here. I'll just start with this. And then we'll do four wood in the next round. And then after that, we'll, like... I, I don't know how aggressively I'm going to take my one-point action. I think I'd rather, honestly, just secure my, my three-point action. I, I, I think I'll take the clay and then a one-point action and then the reed if, if the reed's still there. I think it's a little bit lame to... Uh, like, I don't want to get the clay taken from me. The clay is by far the most points. Um, I mean, I guess that I could take a... It's, it costs me two points to not get the clay here because I, I need to, the clay to feed, but I could take a food action instead. Like, I could take a four food instead and that would cover the clay that I I would need to feed so i could in theory do that instead yeah like four clay into three or four food into three wood is like very similar to six clay like it cost me some points obviously but the six clay is gonna be the most important thing after the four wood here the four wood's two points so i have to take that it's two points regardless so so i still have three actions that are one point actions here um, I still have cow, boar, and veggie are all one-point actions for me, so I'm still good to keep plowing fields, I think. The veggie's, like, so not getting to me, but we can dream. Like, right, cow's gone now. Mm. So one of the actions from Kandinsky is Ren Fence. Yeah, I'm just gonna take this forward now. We'll just take it now. Yeah, it's too many points. Too many points to take this forward now. 
And then we have Veggie and, and Boar as one point actions. There's a plow, but no one's taking the boar though until um, a fence action gets taken. Like I don't think green's ever taking a boar until. Oh, green could take a boar actually. Green could green could in theory let a um, sheep run away and then and then take a boar. That wouldn't be too bad for them. I don't think there's any way green blocks me here, right? They they have to reno fence. They have their feedings figured out. What else are they doing with their actions here? I don't know what else they're doing besides blocking me and getting in my way. Whatever. If the boar and the and the um, other things stay there, okay. Organic farmer. This organic farmer is not great. How many points is this organic farmer? This organic farmer is like not any points at all. God. Also, they're raw eating four uh, veggies here. That feels so bad. That feels outrageously bad that they're raw eating four veggies. What a bummer for them. That is a big bummer. That's a humongous bummerus. All right, what are you doing, Mr. Bois? Oh, they built a hearth. Yeah, they built a hearth, but they don't need the food. Yeah, it's very funny. They took all the clay to build a hearth, but they don't actually need a food from it. That's very funny. Very, very funny. I guess four, um, four food into reedstone food is, is the same. It, it, like, is a good backup in case my reed or my clay gets blocked. Yeah, I think taking a grain. Yeah, it's only one point, I think. Um, yeah, it's only one point. They need. The, they don't have animal space. Grain is just two points there. The Dr. Bot can't plow field. Can take a veggie. So they have veggie and sheep for points. I'm going to be pretty defensive about defending my points. I don't think I can lose if I just max out my points on my guilds. So I think that I'm going to defend my points pretty hard here. Okay, stable. Yeah, stable's a point. It's fine. Makes sense. Um, okay, so now now I can take my um, my clay here. This is super safe. Super duper safe here. And now, okay, now we're fine. If we get blocked on the read, it's not a huge deal at all. It's really not a big deal. Yeah. All right, guilds guilds coming in clutch. Okay, so now I have to take a boar. Now I take a boar here. Um, it could lead to my reed getting blocked, but if it happens, it's not a huge deal, I think. Maybe it is a big deal, actually. Three, six, eight, ten. Yeah, I lose points if that happens. Um, how does green get points outside of reno fencing? Uh, I guess an extra wood is worth a point for them, then? If I take this, then they can take an extra wood that's worth a point. Yeah, I lose two points if if this gets taken. Ah, uh, they have barterer. Yeah, they have barterer. Um, I can't see a way for them to get a point if I take this boar. So therefore, I shouldn't take the boar. Yeah, I don't see a way for them to get a point outside of this boar. So I'll, I'll just take the boar. Yeah, or I'll just take the read. I'll, I'll let you have the boar. I, I I would rather have my two points than than the one point from the the boar. So we'll just take it. We'll let, let him have it. Could always mess up by ren fencing first and and letting not letting a sheep run away. Could always mess that up. So yeah, like it's um oh that's true. I can fence one for a point. Um no, I need uh I need to do. Should plow rather than the cow. Yeah, true. True. I can't fence. No, fencing isn't worth a point, right? I need the food. Yeah, I need the food. I have to eat it. Yeah, I need I need I have perfect amounts of food here. Um oh no no no, I can fence with the clay. I can fence with the clay here. I can I can fence with the clay for a point. I could in theory fence with the clay for a point here. Um, because yeah, I, I have rammed clay. But yeah, you're so you're right. I could fence I could fence for a point here. God, I've been streaming for seven and a half hours of Agricola. What the heck? <laughs> That's a lot of Agricola. Chat, have you been here all day? You're a, a homie. You're the real homie. The real if you've been here all day, you are the actual homie. Because I'm tired. <laughs> I am I am tired. Oh, thank goodness William is playing. Thank goodness William's playing because I have someone to raid after this, by the way. We're gonna raid William after this, because William's playing. Unless there's someone else playing. Wait, is someone else playing? Orna, check really quick. 
Check the Discord, see if anyone else is playing. No, just William, I think. There's no NerdCube. I've seen NerdCube do stuff occasionally, but... Um, oh, that's a good question. There, I, yeah, I would consider streaming other board games. I would consider streaming other board games. Like, I stream other games in general, but yeah, I would consider streaming other board games. I would consider that. Um, I don't like Terra Mystica as much. Like, I'm burned out on Terra Mystica, but, like, in principle, I could do that game. Um, uh, I could do some other crazy games. I could do some other crazy board games. Maybe I could do that. Uh, all right. We're not being nice to you this time. We're not being nice this time. We were, we were nice last time. I mean, you could take a sheep for a point. That's totally fine, too. Yeah, this is a point for me. We'll just do this. Could also fence for a point, but this is also a point for me, so I'll just take this instead. Yeah, I forgot fencing with a clay is a point, but this is better for food, for the resource tie break, so I gotta do this. Better for the resource tie break. Wood, uh, resource tie break. Sheep is worth a point for you, bro. You didn't want a sheep? You didn't want that sheep for a point? God, I'm also really hungry. All I had today was cereal, and cereal, as it turns out, is not filling. I've got to have this game in the bag. I got to have it in the bag. I mean, Green Swarm actually looks like okay here, but they don't have animals. I don't know what I'm scoring here. Who knows what I'm scoring? This has got to be like a 50. This has got to be like a, a middling 50, if I'm if I'm feeling it right. If, I, if I'm reading the, the tarot cards of Agricola right, I feel, I feel the mid-50 which should be good here. Although uh, maybe Alco's game is good too. Like Alco only has three family members. That's the biggest problem with Alco's game here is they only have three family members. Um, if they had more family members, then they would be in good shape, but they only have three. So there is a problem there. Also's organic farmer is not very good. Who knows, dude? Who knows if I'm winning or not? Dr. Boss game's not bad either. I don't know. I don't know, dude. Who knows? I'm, I'm not doing the math. I refuse to do the math. Doing math is for nerds. <laughs> Math is for nerds, okay? We're not doing math because math is for nerds. Oh my gosh, dude, four games today. Also, um, as a reminder, I do have a YouTube channel for uh, board games specifically for playing Agricola. So like, if for some reason you are, are you want more Agricola action, I have a YouTube channel for that. Feel free to check that out. I upload games there every uh, like every once in a while. I just like upload my games from stream, from, from previous streams. So if you're interested in more Agricola, check that out. I, I just, I mean, it's mainly just me uploading my VODs and I have a strategy video. But yeah, check that out if you're interested in that. Um, might be something you're interested in gotta be like a mid 50 here i think i have a complete farm and i have all these guilds maxed so i think it should be like a, a middling 50 but yeah uh that's something to that's something that's worth checking out if, if you're interested in that um, i'll probably upload videos there every once in a while but like definitely i want to balance my board gaming with like my other stuff that i do like i want to balance board gaming and pokemon speed running and other things that i enjoy doing like escape rooms i'll probably do more escape rooms at some point those are really fun um so i want to do some balance things um but uh, yeah, and I think I'm gonna, so this week I might do one bonus stream before Friday, but I'm gonna try and stick to my schedule of Friday Saturday streaming, and I might throw in an extra day at some point, but because of the break I've been streaming a little bit more recently, but, um, I, I probably, school's gonna start up soon, I gotta prepare for some things, so, alright, goodbye cow. The cow may have come home, uh, but we're gonna get rid of this cow, because even though I could hold it, I could, I could put it somewhere, but we'll, we'll just do that. All right, do we win? We won, Pog. Yep, that's about right, middle 50. Let's go. The guilds, yeah, we gilded it up. Doubters? <laughs> Honestly, my draft, like, my draft went very weirdly, uh, and, and, like, I'm happy with where it ended up. I'm happy that we got the clay support. The clay support saved my draft, for sure, because my draft was a mess, because I tried to do frickin'... I tried to wheel some card that didn't wheel and it made me sad. So thank you for the congrats, GG.